figure out a way to get Peter Lawford to take Maria Reeve and Carol Channing to the party tonight. I'd be very, very glad to get away from this girl for my three weeks vacation. Believe me, she's driving me crazy. Where, where are you going on your vacation, though? What did you say? I said, where are you going on your vacation? Oh, I don't know. I just get in my car and drive around. Oh, that's always good. Sure. What, uh, what kind of a car do you drive? <laughs> Will you repeat that for the West Coast, please? <laughs> you say, what kind of car do you drive? Well, let me tell you something, Mr. Law Ford. I mean, henceforth, you'll be known as Mr. Law Buick, not Mr. Law Ford. I happen to drive the best car on the road. <laughs> oh, how I love to drive my Buick. With my sweetheart sitting by my side. Oh. That's right, Milton. Sing it out. And good evening, ladies and gentlemen, especially you ladies. Tonight we have some exceptionally timely advice for you about this business of buying an automobile. It's timely because these are bargain days right now at your Buick dealers. And when it comes to picking bargains, as every husband knows, it's the woman of the house who's the keenest shopper. So I'm going to disqualify myself as a bargain expert tonight in favor of a lady who has just been shopping the automobile showrooms, Mrs. Jan Sherwood. Now, Mrs. Sherwood, would you mind telling our audience how many different automobile showrooms you visited this week? Altogether, Mr. Hayworth, I shopped the showrooms of 12 different makes of cars. Uh, 12. And were they all in the Buick's price class? Well, now, that depends on what you mean by <coughs> Buick's price class. I found, for instance, that some cars among the so-called low price three actually cost more than some Buicks. And that's just one of several surprising facts that I'm afraid most folks who are shopping for car bargains don't realize about Buick. Mm -hmm. Well, uh, why don't you take it from here and let our audience in on them all, huh? <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Hayward. And I think I'll take that Buick special over there as a typical Buick bargain. Now, if I were going to pick the bargain of bargains of all 12 cars I shopped this week, it would certainly be this beautiful big Buick sedan. And I found that this Buick delivered for appreciably less than several models of the low price three, despite the fact that it gives you so much more cars. Specifically, as my notes show, this Buick has from 15 to 30 more horsepower. More room inside front and rear. And here's what my notes say about the demonstration ride I took in each of them. Frankly, there just isn't any comparison. And I wish I had time to show you my notes on all the cars that I compared with Buick. It really makes you wonder, how can Buick give you so much for so little? <laughs> I know, Mrs. Sherwood. I've uh, often wondered that myself. But all you have to do is to... Look at the rock-bottom figures on the price tag on this big Buick two-door six-passenger sedan. Just stack this price against that on other cars you might consider. And remember, it includes standard equipment charged for as extras by others. It also includes delivery in the very city in which your TV station is located. You certainly can't beat Buick bargains. More than that, Mr. Hayworth, I was amazed at the high trade-in allowances Buick dealers are now offering. They're just about tops, I found. And that's mighty important, Mr. Sherwood. When you subtract the top allowance for your present car from this low price, you sure got yourself a money-saving bargain. But definitely. And I do hope you folks out there will check this with your Buick dealers. This week, for sure. That's right, folks. You couldn't pick a better time to see. Uh -huh. For I know that very soon I'll go on my honeymoon, my Buick. My love and I. Pete. What happens at dress rehearsals? We get applause for commercials. Pete, let's.